So looking at the motor, it's the original 340 block. You see it's blue. That's where they were painted in the latter half of 71. Um, now, I have the original intake, um, the Torker 340 intake for the car. I have the original rad. Um, the rest of it has been modified uh, to make the car safer and run better, faster certainly, and more reliable. So there's a, uh, as you can see, the aluminum fan and rad, uh, electric fan, I'm sorry, and uh, aluminum rad. That came from uh, Summit uh, Racing. The, uh, the top of the motor is an RPM air gapper, uh, dual plane, with a 650 Mighty Demon carb. Uh, there's no choke, and it's it's the um, manual uh, four barrel kick down, if you will. It's got uh, hooker competition uh, headers on it, which run into a um, the one and five eighths run into a three inch sorry three inch collector, and then it's a custom three inch exhaust all the way to the back. That was done by a, a speed shop in Whitby, Ontario, and it's all tucked up underneath the car. Uh, it's got mufflers on it. It's got uh, the Flowmaster 40s. Anybody that's watched the videos, it's uh, it's louder than heck, but uh, it really, really works well. The car came with four-wheel drums. I had those switched out to the Wildwood uh, discs at the front, power assist. Still has the drums on the back. Um, that was the singular best thing that I did on this car, putting those uh, Wildwood uh, discs on it. It stops like a, like a modern car and uh, just makes you feel comfortable um, operating, the car, operating the car out in traffic.